Yeah, yeah most of a meat bowl. Yeah. We might get a deer so big we can't hang it. We'll just skin it right on the ground. Right. No bacon cut for the No, I do have one. They work awesome, man. Ooh, there we go, look at that. Hey. We got to get the deer. Oh boy, what a morning. I haven't received one doe and we've hiked right around five miles this morning, real slow. Like we've just been right on this meadow and that backs up into some trees, this uh, small tree line and then a, then a road. And uh, we've had a friend text us showing us pictures of big bucks in here recently, like literally a day ago, two days ago. And uh, we haven't seen shit. Very little sign. Um, I think we're going to switch it up and go a little higher tomorrow morning. Or uh, uh, later this afternoon, sorry. And then tomorrow morning we're going to try a different place. But um, I'm sitting here waiting for Steve. I'm in this old ass campground. It's an old forestry service campground. Um, it has this really cool old stove uh, with a chimney on it. So uh, with like a cooking plate on top. It's really cool. It's It's got to be... 70 years old probably probably 80 years old i i, I maybe even in older I, I don't know um i keep forgetting it's f almost freaking 2020 um but i'm gonna tear into some of this whiskey hill smokehouse jerky i forgot water <laughs> like an idiot and uh because i we were rushing this morning woke up a tiny bit late god it was cold thank god for mr heater buddy or whatever the hell it's called saved our asses and coffee so um, I'm going to chill here, wait for Steve. Steve's out in this meadow. He's following some tracks, and we split up to cover more ground, and that's why we're not filming as much. But uh, I'm going to sit here and enjoy this jerky and wait for his ass. Typically when they've came out, they've came out from over in there. And I usually I'll call from over there. I've seen some fucking monsters just below the tracks, but not on the side he's talking about. Long time ago, me and my dad were coyote hunting and we're driving along on his side. I lock him up because it was a total shock. There was probably 10 does and a buck that, he was probably 20-ish by maybe 18, not anything real special, but the mass all the way up was insane and the deer looked like he weighed 300 pounds. So my dumb self got out and tried to see how close I could get. He was rutted up pretty good, he didn't like that. This isn't uh, a good road for a full size, that's for sure, but we uh, went off the map, the road has changed since maps were done last so we turned around we're on our way back out steve thought he just found something so he bailed and thought he found some garbage so we try to pick that up as much as we can with like a coat see if he found anything but just went through
through this cool meadow uh, and uh, try to do a little shortcut. It turned out to be a long cut. for a couple hours. <sighs> There's gotta be something in here. I just, that was about 20 yards from my doe. Actually, she's right now, she's, <sighs> Jesus. She's about 40 yards below me, just feeding. She doesn't give a shit that I'm in. Steve's already seen 20 deer and passed on at Fork and Horn. So, <sighs> God, this is tough. Took a quick rest. This is uh, beating the shit out of me. I'm definitely not happy with my boot situation or my socks, I think. They're too warm. Thought it was gonna be a lot colder today. It said the high was supposed to be like 48 or 50, with the lows of 20. And it was cold this morning, but not as cold as it was the first couple nights. So I'm sweating a little more on my feet, which is causing hot spots. And at my size, that's no good. So. Uh, took a little rest here, let my socks dry out, put some mole skins on, and uh, a little preventive, preventative care. Now I'm going to hike this back, or not back, going to keep going straight, scale this mountain and drop down into the timber, and then back to the truck and figure some shit out. I need to go take a shower at Steve's and then uh, go back up. I think I'm going gonna, I'm, I'm gonna to do the rest of this trip in the deep timber. I, I'm fucking done with this mountain. We've seen so many does and little bucks, and we found big sheds. No shooters. It's just aggravating. <laughs> 